Judy, when I say licorice, what do you think about? My favorite candy. <laughs> <laughs> but it turns out there's a lot more to licorice than just sweets, as you recently discovered in our Herbal Insight. You're absolutely right, Olivia. When I spent some time with Mark Blumenthal of the American Botanical Council, I learned that licorice is an herb of many talents. One of the most versatile herbs in the world is licorice. It's probably one of the top five or ten most commonly used herbs in all of traditional Chinese medicine. From a medicinal standpoint, licorice has several well-established and well-documented properties. One of these properties is its medicinal demulcent effect. Demulcents are herbs or agents that have a topically soothing effect on irritated mucous membranes. Consequently, licorice has been a favorite ingredient in cough syrups and other throat syrups for over a hundred years. One thing people need to recognize is that most of the licorice candy sold in the United States is not made with licorice whatsoever. Most licorice candy is made with anise seed oil, which is a natural flavoring that tastes somewhat like licorice, but is not in any way related to licorice whatsoever. Anise is from the carrot family, licorice is in the pea family. Licorice has often been used as a natural sweetener, either with or without the addition of sucrose or table sugar. One of the ways that licorice is found in the U.S. market is in a tea blend that uses licorice for its demulcent properties, along with the added effect of herbs like slippery elm and marshmallow, all of which combine to give a soothing effect to irritation of the mucous membranes of the throat. Normally when someone is making a cup of licorice tea, they make it one cup at a time, and since licorice is usually more dense because it's a root, you want to steep it for a longer period of time, say 10 minutes or 15 minutes, to get the full benefit and flavor from the licorice. Mark says looking for the organic certification on licorice products is really important. He says licorice is usually wildcrafted, which means that the harvesters go out into wild areas and they pull the plants out of the ground because of its roots and because that's where the valuable parts are. And that's why the organic certification is so important because that ensures that the licorice plants are being harvested in a way that's sustainable for the long term.